Hi everyone, my name is Eddie. Welcome to my kitchen. Today, I'm gonna show you how to make a golden prawn fried rice. If you like our channel and would like to support us, just click the link below and buy us a cup of coffee. All right, let's get it started. All right, first Abel, what we're going to prepare is our vegetable. And first I got the, the carrot here, which already peeled the skin. Uh, if you like to go with skin on, it's no problem. It's, it's another option if you like it, but uh, make sure your skin is, made, is clean. So what I'm normally do, just make the dice. Okay, all right, then we just just chop into the dice. Okay. Okay, the dice ready. Okay, then we can stand by on the side. Okay. And uh, okay. The second ingredient I have here is the spring onion, also called a green onion. Now in this I'm gonna show you. The, my technique, I wanna showing you my technique, sorry. I'm gonna showing you a uh, like tip is the spring onion. Okay, first we have to separate the part. So like this is most like a spring onion, the white part. Okay, we have to separate on the side. Okay, then this, we just rest of the green part. Okay, now then this one also we can stand by separately on the side okay like that okay then next ingredient what i have here is the this is the, called a green piece and this is is already per cooked you can easy to get the local supermarket from frozen so all you need to just take a portion out and defrozen and ready to go okay that is most of the simple one and easy one okay we also can stand by here now all my veg here uh, for me that's enough and of course all right the next ingredient what i have here that is the fresh coriander i just uh, wash in the water all right clean you can stand by all right and next what i got the main ingredient here is the prongs and this is the you can easy to get the local store uh, it's fro frozen and cooked. So all you need is just defrozen and ready to go. So all we need to do is just give them a light seasoning. Okay, just sprinkle a little bit of salt and uh, some pepper. Okay, you can use white pepper if you like. Just give them a good stir. For the prong, have light seasoning. Then stand by. Okay, on the side. Next, what I'm going to prepare is the eggs. Yeah. Today I'm gonna use about uh, two eggs. Okay, and uh, get the two. All right. Okay, then this, the rice, what I'm here. Remember, always don't use the fresh steamed rice because it's getting too sticky. The best way is the steamed rice, then you leave, let it cool down and leave it in the fridge overnight. So it become like this, uh, very easy to loosen into the part, it won't be too sticky. So that is the one important tip. So now, the technique I'm showing you today, just take your egg yolk out. Okay, then straight into our rice, like that. Okay. Okay, good. Then that the, first we're going to do, just this is the balance side. Mix egg yolk with the rice together. All right. That is the we call the golden fried rice. Mean is the egg yolk is that golden color. Then coating all every single pieces of the rice. So at the same time also can help the when we fry the rice can help rice easy to separate. All right. Then. Another tip is, in this stage, add a little bit of oil. Okay, you don't need much, just tiny oil. 
This also can help to cover all the rice. Then while after we going to fry, and it's also easy to separate. Okay, you see now uh, stand by on the side, and also prepare yourself. This is the today's secret ingredient: butter. All right, just because that butter will give you this fried rice uh, at uh, quite some like a creamy uh, texture. Okay, like this. So I will show you. We're going to use later, and this is optional. All right, this I have the Chinese Shaoxing wine. If you like alcohol flavor, you can just leave it. And if you don't have a Shaoxing rice wine, you can also replace it with the sherry. Okay, sherry wine also can work in. Okay, I like this just fragrant. All right, first we let's go heat our wok. Uh, if you don't have wok, also can use the pan, but try to find the deepest pan as possible. Uh, much easier when you're going to turn it. Okay, when you're going when you're going to stir. All right, now as you see, the smoke smoke start coming out. In this time, let's start add into the oil. You don't need to shy with oil. Okay, I put the, about a three tablespoon. Okay, there another tip I want to show you. Now it's smoke, right? Turn off your heat. Okay, then go to like the spring onion, the white part first. Okay. You see my heat still off. Okay, in this stage, what I'm trying to create is the spring onion flavor into our oil. If you keep a high heat all the time, then it will easy to burn in the spring onion. That's why if you cannot control, don't know how to control, simple. Turn off the heat. Then let this red heat to create our like aroma oil. Okay, in there. Okay, until you can see it started lighting brown, then back on the heat. Like that. Okay, you got uh, back on the heat. And in this stage, let's go into our egg white part. Okay, this egg white. Okay, now heat go up, go in. Okay, then get the good stir. Okay, like that. Okay, ready? You can see all the edit white part change color. Now it's time to do go into our carrot and uh, the green part of the spring onion. You can in. Okay, then get the keep a stir. Okay, once the fragrance come in, now ready. Go into our rice. Okay. Just keep in. Okay, good. Now, then, we just keep a stir. Like that. This here, another tip I want to share with you. When you're doing the stir fry rice, don't chop, you see, don't chop your spatula to the right because it's easy to break in the rice into the part. So just like gently cutting stir. When they heat up into the rice, then you will start coming separate, as you can see. All right. And also in this technique, because we put egg yolk into the rice first. So I would like to say it's very hard to get in fail. So don't worry. Just give a good stir like that. Okay. Then we keep a stir for about uh, two minutes. As you can see, all the egg white start changing the color. Okay, now it's time to put into our prongs because as I told you, this prong is already cooked and frozen. So all we need is just let the heat up our prong. And of course, the, uh, this ingredient is our pea to making nice green colors. All right, Let's put on the side. Then just keep a stir. So all the way from now, I all keep in the high heat. Okay, now let's get uh, some seasoning. Get uh, about a uh, half teaspoon of salt and I uh, like some pepper. You can use white pepper if you like, but the black pepper giving it a nice fragrance. After seasoning in, okay, keep a stir. Then, now is our time to 
add into our butter. The butter what I have here is about the one tablespoon. Okay, now we start to create a nice creamy butter flavor into the rice. All right, and also at the same time because the butter is like oil, you see the rice getting shiny and like glossy, so beautiful. All right, then give it a good stir. Okay, now almost done. Eh? Last ingredient is that. All right, Saoxing rice wine. What I normally do, put in the spatula, then put just put it on the edge. Now, I give you nice, beautiful Saoxing rice wine forever comes out. And last heat is that the alcohol, that alcohol vibrates. So you don't really taste the alcohol, but the, only, but the, the fragrance, the Saoxing rice wine fragrance will keep there. Okay, that is done. Now, heat off, then we start to grating. Okay, now it's ready to serve. Uh, just grating our beautiful rice into the plate. Or you can serve it in a bowl. Okay. Look how beautiful it is. Simple. Beautiful, nice. Okay, and then remember, I do prepare some nice coriander. If you like, uh, look more fancier. Okay, pick up a couple of the prongs on the side. Let's clean up a little bit. Then final garnish with our pick cup of the coriander. Let's just pick up a couple of the leaf. Then okay. And also, I would like some just quick chop. Okay, rubber chop. Then just get a good sprinkle on the edge. All right, here we are. Nice, simple, golden prawn fried rice. Try yours at home. Really delicious. All right, let me dig in. Look, beautiful. Okay, I'm going to show you. Look, how beautiful rice. Oh, fluffy. Nice. I wish you can smell. Yeah, very nice fragrance come out. Okay, let's pick up my rice all together. Hot. Nice. Hmm, beautiful. All fragrant. Nice prone flavor. And especially the first technique, as I show you, the spring onion aroma oil. Just all coating in the right. And start coming to your mouth and nose. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. All right. Simple, easy, nice, delicious. All right, this is my how to make golden prawn fried rice. Simple, easy, and delicious. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, don't forget to click like and subscribe. Of course, if you have any question, you're welcome to leave a comment below. i see you next time on Eddie's Kitchen.